Welcome back to Financial Fridays. This is our final episode in the Home Ownership Series. I am your host, Alexia Campbell, Senior Financial Services Specialist at the VM Building Society. On our last episode, we looked at the fundamentals of saving for home ownership and we examined how you can go about setting realistic expectations. On this episode, we will get you started on your home ownership savings journey. Let's go. From our previous episode, we are aware that there are several costs associated with purchasing a property in Jamaica. These costs include your down payment, closing costs, monthly mortgage payment, taxes, maintenance, and insurance costs. Now this may seem very overwhelming to you. Where will you find this money? Don't worry, at VM, we have the perfect product for you. It is called the I Save for Home. Let's discuss this. As we think about saving for home ownership, there are three things that we must bear in mind. First, we must set a clear goal for saving. Then we must develop our savings plan. And finally, consider decreasing your expenses or increasing your income. Setting a clear goal. Now in setting your goal, it's all dependent on the price of the property that you're seeking to purchase. From our previous episode, we looked at the member who wanted to purchase a property for 20 million. Now remember, we recommend that you save anywhere between 10 to 20% of the purchase price to help you with the associated costs for purchasing this property. For a property of 20 million, you're looking at savings of anywhere between two and four million dollars. How will you achieve this? What is the timeline in which you wish to achieve it? This is what we mean when we say set a clear goal. Now, let's look at developing your savings plan. When you are considering purchasing a home, it is time to look at your finances. It is time to separate the savings for the home from your regular savings and your other expenses. We want the home ownership saving to be a priority. As remember, we are talking about your dream home. This is definitely a priority. And so here at VM, we recommend our iSafe product to assist you with saving for your home ownership. Finally, let's talk about decreasing your expenses or increasing your income. Yes, we know we love to purchase KFC on a Friday, but maybe it's time to hold that back until you are in your dream home. And next, do you have a talent that you give away for free? Can you do makeup? Are you a hairstylist? Do you do all the kids in your neighborhood's hair on a Sunday for free? Maybe now is the time to start charging a small fee. This will help you to achieve your dream of home ownership. By now, I've mentioned the I Save for Home quite a number of times. I bet you're wondering, what on earth is the I Save for Home? It is pretty simple. It is a savings product that was developed by the VM Group to help you to reach your goal of home ownership. It basically allows you to set a monthly savings amount and we place that into a fixed deposit account for a fixed period of time. The tenure and the amount is solely based on you, dependent on the type of property that you're seeking to purchase, the price for the property, and what your saving goal is. And also, you must bear in mind the timeline in which you wish to reach this saving goal. For example, if you wish to save $2 million within five years, you would be looking at a monthly saving of approximately $32,000 per month in your iSafe for home. Have no idea how to calculate this savings for yourself? Never fear. On our website, we have a savings calculator just for you. Visit the VM Group website, select our savings calculator, enter the amount that you wish to achieve and when you wish to achieve the amount, and we will tell you what it is that you need to save on a monthly basis to meet this goal. You may ask, what are the benefits to me on doing this I save for home? 
Chief benefit is that it helps you to reach your savings goal for home ownership. But at VM, we believe in giving you additional perks. And so you will enjoy a reduction in your mortgage interest rate and a discount on your property valuation. Now that you know all about the iSave for Home, I'm sure you want to know how to get started on this great savings journey. First, visit our website to determine your monthly amount that is required based on the property you're seeking to purchase and the savings goal you wish to achieve. Secondly, visit your nearest VM location. When you are going, bring with you your ID, your TRN, a proof of income, and a proof of address. Our willing and able team stands ready to help you to establish your I Save for Home as you seek to reach your home ownership journey. To recap, let us remember that as we save towards our goal of home ownership, we must set a realistic goal, we must develop our savings plan, and we must either decrease our expenses or increase our income. And never forget, you need the VM, I save for home. And just like that, we have come to the end of our home ownership series, where we would have helped you to realize your goal of home ownership, how to get started, setting expectations, and most importantly, using your I save for home to save toward this goal of home ownership. Continue to watch Financial Fridays every month as we bring you something new to help you on your financial journey in this life. To get started with VM, feel free to give us a call at 876-754-8627 or send us an email at manager at myvmgroup.com. I am Alexia Campbell, and it has been my pleasure to be a part of this wonderful series. If you wish to contact me, you may reach me at alexia.campbell at myvmgroup. You take care.